Hello everyone and welcome back to Let's Play Gladius. This is LP Showboat 0099 and today we are going to go get Hell's Fury. Oh, but I really hope I can do this relatively quickly. What we need to do is we need to head back to the Expanse now. We pretty much only came here to call to grab some equipment. Go ahead and rest. I don't really care about days passing. Any battles we come across, we can just leave. Simple as that. Uh, there should be a guy down by the sea to travel to the Expanse. Maybe. Maybe. Yeah, there's a boat. Um. So the boat will take you to anywhere, but we're gonna go to the Expanse. I don't really care about the fee. The fee is meaningless at this point. We have ways. We have a ton of equipment that we could sell and just max out our stockpiles of dinars or whatever the hell this game claims to use as its currency. So we need to go down here. That looks suspicious. I found a bottle. It appears to have fresh water in it. Right. Hi. Give water. Okay, so this is something we could have done a long time ago. We can't take from you. So yes, doing that, you get a, a passive ability for both Ursula and Valens, and apparently received XP. Where now, we will be able to be completely immune to bleeding if we're playing with our Dervish. Oh, I did not, I do not want to fight that battle, thanks. Come on, game. Yeah, I'd rather not. I mean, it is experience and all, but no. Screw you. Screw off, we've got more important battles. So. Right, I need to go into Sarazel first, because we technically need to finish. Are you fucking kidding me? Would you not? Two dark cats and a dark legionnaire. No. Alright, I need to go to the shop. So we need to show her that we got the tablet back. Anyway. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Alright, come on, get your banter over with, please. Okay, so we're done with that now. Officially. However. Never mind. 
If we go down here now. There's that. You want to save before even attempting this, which is exactly what I'm going to do. And I might be here a while. Maybe. You'll know if I do this first try. Yeah, our last meeting with Serenantet was merely a precursor. You won't be able to return until you finish the quest within the portal. Promise Stone and the Signet are part of a greater whole. Yeah. Prove ourselves against an impossible challenge. I am ready. I'm as ready as I'm ever going to be. Requires level 18 and higher, and no summoners or undead casters allowed, even though we are facing nothing but summoners. Pretty much, that's all we're facing. We are. This is an endurance league against a butt-ton of summoners. These guys do not have any holy miters. We might see some with Holy Miters as we go along. Maybe. Maybe. I do not have a lot of heavies. This is bad, but what I do have are very, very strong characters. These guys are very strong, plus I have death on my Samnite, plus I have Ameliorate, plus I have this Dervish who will be completely immune, as in fully immune to anything that they throw at me. Note, however, every character that you take is going to get Hell's Fury. So you're going to want to take the characters that you feel give the best opportunities to use Hell's Fury. Which means you're going to want to take a medium, a light, a heavy, and a support for this at the very least. We are taking EG as our, uh, as our ranged support and we're taking our channeler for healing. Ideally, they won't actually, these two won't actually take any damage, and uh, Valens pretty much is just gonna hang back. But uh, let's see, I certainly would love to have my Secular get experience here. Thing is, not all of them are gonna be wind, so even though she would be immune to Far Strike, she would not be immune to any beasts other than the air beasts that might get summoned. So, we are going to pass on the secular, on, on the dervish, and we're going to take our secular, even though I would love to take our gungner to have an additional ranged unit. We need to have some more melee, and my little secular here can do a ton of damage. So, flat map, completely flat map, I'm going to set up like this, so that those two can go up and quickly get their shots in. And that's pretty much how we're going to be. Let's hope for the best, this might not actually be the best uh, party arrangement, but uh... And I might have to actually wait on this, to be completely honest. I might need to wait until we have more characters level 18, and we, like, if we're able to recruit people who are 18, we might have to wait until we can recruit level 18 so that we can get more heavies. Uh, preferably more heavies that can use, uh, death. Alright, get some damage off. Gotta love it. Uh, 
let's do that route to him, please. How much did you get out of that? If I steal affinity now from her, or from anyone, actually, uh, I will get one unit. As it turns out, I've, I, I, I finally actually remembered and slash noticed that even if you steal affinity from someone who has no affinity, you still get given one uh, circle of affinity no matter what. One, you get as a minimum one circle for your 3 SP, so we're going to use that and then we're going to essentially wait to steal more, essentially. Gods, watch over us. Yeah, they're going to go and do their steal power and all that good crap. I mean, summon power. So ideally, what I probably should have done was teleported to get closer to those guys so I could steal from them, but meh. Goal is to take as little damage as possible. Bear this in mind. Could my heavies please move? Thank you. Yeah, we're gonna we're gonna be able to move right now. Let's go. And then Plexara will get to move. She is going to teleport a bit closer. Right about there would be good. That would be good because that would give me access, I think, to everyone. The problem is they could then uh, summon on top of her, so she'll go there. Looks like they're probably going to summon on top of her anyway. Oh god, Dark Air Beasts. All right, then. Yeah, just surround Plexara. At least she has a Holy Miter available to her. Those guys will die. I mean, they'll die quickly is the point here. So, I mean, these front guys. I'm not too worried. I am not too worried. Yeah, do that. Sure. Show. Do 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 do. do. Yeah, go ahead. I don't really care so much because she has the Holy Miter. The Holy Miter can activate in each stage of the battle, so even if she starts at half health, she essentially has full health. I mean, it's pretty much. Yeah, you're going there. Fail. Oh well. Alright, so I'm going to steal Affinity from someone. Uh, let's go for you. Uh, essentially, I'm just going to steal and then teleport away. How, do like a hit and run tactic. Uh, because, oh, okay. You're going to, you're just going to come to me, huh? Uh, Pixara will be able to move again very, 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 very shortly. Really? Okay. Good, blocked. One would think they would use Far Strike, but oh well. Let's hope for death. That would be ideal. Do, 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 do. Death, good. He gone. You beaten. And this guy came up to me, which is nice, and he's within range of surprise attack. Freaking missed the first crit, that's sad. But uh, surprise attack should kill him. Uh, the air beasts get their turns before my secular does, so... Oh, I don't have four? Really? Really? 
I thought I would steal... Uh, I didn't get one full unit, did I? Oops. Okay, good. I actually have a line on him. But he is wind. Oh right, everyone's wind. I can't. I can't do a damn thing because everyone's wind. <laughs> and yeah, don't forget, Plexara is sort of uh, really powerful. As in, really powerful. At this very point in time, should I put her there or should I just go like way out to here? Or something like that. Actually, that might be a good spot. Yeah, do all your moving, I don't really mind. That guy happens to be in a nice spot for me. Uh, I'd have to move really close for that. Uh, no. Alright, EG, you're gonna go there. Okay. Defense down and petrified. And initiative down. Yeah, very nice shield on her. Oh, but that's an unfortunate spot for her to be in. Thankfully, I can do this. Goodbye. I haven't actually taken too, too much damage, which is good. There are two left. He is petrified right now, and this will remove the petrification, but I'm fine with it. Unfortunately, that doesn't mean he's facing the wrong direction, but oh wells. I will take that affinity, thank you very much. Want to deny as much as possible. And I could actually do a lot of damage to him. Without really having to spend affinity, apparently. Or spend too much of it. You know, I'll do it. I, I don't care. Yeah. Get spanked. Now, does that actually use two, or does it... Yeah, it only uses the amount that it says. No, no, she's still draining. Yeah, it does use two. It does use the full two. I don't know why it says it doesn't, but it oh wills. Death, please. Do -do, do -do -do, do -do -do. Only a 35% chance. Ooh, good. Double death. And then there was one. Aww. Uh, so you can pass now. You have to, like, move a lot to get him, but... Yeah, good. Round one is going well thus far, I think. Fairly well. Ah, you're summoning power. Good. That's what I want to see. Ah, that's also what I want to see. Oh, I can't steal right now. I can do running attack, though. Maybe I'll get death three times in a row with attacking here. That would be really nice. Do, 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 do. Nope. How unfortunate. Oh, that is really, un really unfortunate. Okay. Well, whatever. Oh, I don't have enough for combo two. How sad. And Rampage is only like 52 accuracy. What about Gore? 74. Nah. Nah. We'll just do this. 
I can't lose. Didn't kill him, that's unfortunate. Lexara, please have a move. Oh, he's not close enough. Well, alrighty then. Uh, we'll just steal from her so we have enough for an ameliorate from the very beginning of the next battle. And we'll go ahead and just pass, and she can hit him from there, so we'll do long shot too and hopefully kill him. Good. Three more waves of summoners, and then Serenantet. So I'm assuming we're going to have one wave of each affinity, and then we're going to face Serenantet. Serenantet, or whatever. Next wave. These guys are the Earth Wave. Okay. Go down that route, hey, essentially going to... Do the same exact strategy as last time, because that turned out really well. For the exception that I'm not going to teleport my channeler all that close to get her sim immediately surrounded. Although that actually might be a good plan, because... See, anyone need to be ameliorated right now? Probably not. I mean, Langston's doing fine. Ameliorate can pretty much cover half the health of Langston, and he's he's got not too shabby amount of health. Uh, Ducker has uh, reduced damage, so he he'll always take half. In fact, I should have probably put reduced damage on everyone before entering this battle, but whatever. I want to teleport to there, maybe. Get myself in the middle, just to have range. Everyone summons power. I can feel free to combo attack now. With her. Doesn't she have combo 3? Pretty sure she has combo 3 now. I'm pretty sure that I gave that to her recently. I ended up using combo 2 last time. Perhaps I should have been using combo three. Go, go, go. Go, 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 little Langston. Uh, I send Valens up there for the... Oh, okay, so you're still gonna end up putting them right by my... Chandler. I'm fine with that, to be completely honest. He's gonna put that next to him. I'm fine with that, actually. I'm perfectly okay with that. So uh, what I'll do is I'll just teleport my channeler out, probably send her. All right, running attack you. Send her over to the side of the arena now. Pretty much she's bait. That's essentially what the channeler is at this point in time. She is bait. Hit him. She's gonna get hit once by that guy, but not worried in the slightest because holy miter. Don't really like hitting Valens, but meh. And that one's also going to come for Valens. That one's going to go for him. Okay. Valens might be surrounded for a little bit until this guy dies. Hopefully death does go off immediately. But uh, I am going to teleport to there. No. No. I'm going to teleport... Now, I'm going to be a little sneaky about this, because when Langston gets to move, he's going to go behind him. So, yeah, that is fine. Ah, you chose to be petrified. But it doesn't look like the petrification actually worked. Sad. It happens. Ooh, perfect 69. 
I need to move Valens. I'm just saying. Just saying. So yeah, I'm gonna move here to attack him and then he'll die from combos and stuff like that. Do 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 I can't lose. Oh, that he's actually pretty close to death. Just gonna point that out. Running attack, hopefully death goes off on this guy. If not, Valens is just a little boned. But this is why we have Ameliorate. Death did not go off. Okay, Valens. If you can move, you better move. Like now. This will at least remove one of the Dark Beasts. Because they don't have Holy Miters. Valens is going to be surrounded on four sides, isn't he? That's not good. Um, can I combo you? Oh, you're out of range. Okay, well then. Uh, teleport to... There? I think there. Yeah, there. Maybe she'll draw the attention. Ooh, summoning power. And I do hope she's in range for Ameliorate. I hope that's a thing. I'm pretty sure that's the Earth Beast that'll move next, so... I should go here, but it's gonna move regardless, so... May as well just be here. Get the surprise attack off. Oh, that it wasn't. Okay. So it's you and, of course, the surround. Oh, that's not good. That just, just gonna point that out. Okay, hopefully one of these gives me death. Good, one of them gave me death. So two of them are gone now. Uh, empower self will help me, so I believe that's what I'll use here in this situation instead of trying to run away because the earth beast is just going to chase me down. So, empower self, I'll have to ameliorate him. Hopefully, he's in range and has a direct line of sight. Good. Block does go up. Okay, go after him there, so that EG can attack him. Do 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 do. Awesome. All right, and he is out of range. Okay. Ah, uh, that's bad. I can kill him, but I need to kill him. Uh, I could tornado that area, get them away from Valens, but I don't really see the need to. Fire Tempest would do a ton of damage to him. But, no. I need to move just that one square over. Go long shot. Good damage. They won't be able to kill Valens before I can heal him, at the very least. 
Uh, if I move Ducker, she won't have a line of sight anymore. I think passing is in my best interest here. Oh, that's sad. She has to combo now. Didn't kill him, that's unfortunate. Go, go, combos! Goodbye. One to go. When Plexara has her move, she's gonna heal. Valens, please. Or I can just inflict death on this guy this turn and heal Valens at the start of the next wave, which is also a valid tactic. Death did not go off, so I will heal Valens. Valens' shield is almost gone, which is sad, because I like that shield. Oh good, he went after Ducker. Okay, Valens, this is your big day. Give me combo attacks. So Valens is gonna have five uh, affinity, and he has affinity attack four, so... That means I can start the next, uh, how much affinity, ooh. Thanks for that charge. Thank you for all three of those. You are not using Earth 4 today. Yeah, I'll kill you. I don't really care. I have a lot of affinity on my characters now. Okay, and now that my mic decided to work again, it was it just randomly stopped, but good thing I was watching to pay attention to when it randomly stopped, so didn't lose too much. So that last battle went fairly well. I did decide to um attack on Plexara. Valens is gonna start this battle with Air 4. These are all uh, fire affinity this time. Okay, I'm fine with that. This is round three of four. I mean five, technically. Round three of five, you are starting with air four, baby. Air four, go! We get to see what Air 4 actually looks like. So, hello, Avatar of the Air God. Hitting everyone for like 70 something damage. It's damage. I'm fine with damage. Uh, I will steal affinity from you, because you don't really need it right now. 
that you don't even have earth attacks. Those guys are going to summon... Uh, they're going to put their dudes in pretty difficult locations, I'm pretty sure. But uh, at least Valens is safe right now. So is Plexara. What I need to do is make sure that I can heal Myrcilla and... Uh, Langston this time around. They're the ones who are going to need healing next, especially in fact, Ursula. I think I'll just heal now or the next time she gets hit because she is starting to run low. Uh, I can take more affinity, but I don't need to. I don't have air four which would actually do twice the amount of damage than what Air 4 did to uh, them from Valens. But since I don't have it, I will need to teleport. And I'm going to teleport to this side of the arena. Yeah, I'm going to this side of the arena. I would not be surprised if they might put one of their beasts in the path of Myrcilla, like directly in her path. Seems like that that's one of, uh, gonna be what happens. Oh, they put it beside her. Okay, I'm fine with that. Everyone else looks like they're just gonna put it next to them. And we'll see what happens. We shall see what happens. Now that is a little bit close to EG, but I, hmm, I don't really mind having it close to EG. Do my normal running attack here. Do 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 do. do. That should. Oh, thought you were gonna go for uh. Nice little secular there, but apparently not. Okay. I'll take it. Valens, I guess, can make his way this way. Uh, Plexara is currently not in range of anyone. Uh, I guess she will teleport again. Uh, I suppose she can go there? Meh? Sure. It's rather an offensive placing, but it does put her in range to use combo attacks. <clears throat> use her combo three. Although I do need to ameliorate uh, Marcilla the next time she gets hit. Oh, thank you for coming to me. I am very thankful for you coming to me, so that means I can just combo three you from the start and give me the best opportunities to inflict death on you. Fail. None of it inflicted death. That is sad. It's like 30-something percent chance on each hit. Uh, and it doesn't do it. Oh, super crits, you're killing me, man. Smack him. We are actually in a pretty damn good position. We are in a good position here. Yeah, that doesn't matter. Um, oh, that's sad. Okay, I'll take that. Oh yeah, his shield is like gone. 
now, so uh, that could be, prove to be a bit of a problem. I'm gonna go around here to hit this guy. Ideally, I would hit the other one, because this one would die anyway. Okay, so I do not have the line of sight that I need for this guy, because he moved. So very sad. So I guess I'm teleporting there. Okay, I'm fine with that. The problem is I'm going to be moving to kill the other dude. Yes, again, Valens is completely surrounded, but meh. Don't need to do surprise. Because he, he's really low anyway. Okay, combo one, please. Give me death. Give me liberty or give me death. Thank you for death. Would have thought I'd ever be saying that. Thank you for death. Uh, E.G. a little pointless now, in her current position. With Langston down to half health. Alright, Marcilla got hit, she's getting healed. She is getting healed the next time she can move. Really have to go all the way up there, gosh. Ah! Wow, that shield is lasting a long ass time. Alright, well, what I can do is I can freeze this bastard. Then Marcilla can come around to be within my ameliorate line of sight. Ice storm. Which will be good. Hell, sprint attack would actually... Well, running attack would be a good option here. I don't trust sprint, even during the best of times, because of the uh, speed of which that meter fills. Uh, see, I'm in this sticky situation now where I need to heal two people. I can only heal one. Must go around because SP. Thankfully, I'm gonna be filling up my affinity on Valens. I think I'll probably just steal from Valens, to be completely honest, uh, at the start of the next battle. So that I can heal myself up. So sad, I would like to do a lot more uh, combos, but uh, not with Plexara, mind you. But it doesn't look like I'm going to have that opportunity. Doesn't really matter who I heal here, likely going to be Marcilla, because she's more squishy. That damned shield is still... Alive and kicking. I mean, there isn't even really a bar left on that shield HP. It's like the shield's unbreakable for Valens. It's almost like his shield is unbreakable. But I know it's not. Okay, so she gets healed. This guy unfortunately gets an attack off. And again! Again! It doesn't break the shield. Alright, how much did that heal her? Nearly full. Good. I'm happy. I can't lose. No death. The fight continues. Valens can fill his affinity meter. Which I am fine with, and that is the end of round three. On to round four. Two more to go. But the second one should be a 
bit quicker. Let's get this party started. Yeah, let's definitely get this party started. So, my initial move will be the normal. Hit the guy that's closer to me. These are water affinity. Because they're blue. Yeah, I'm gonna probably just go my normal route around deal. that way. I need to steal some affinity. Let's take from Langston. We're gonna be healing Langston, so may as well take from him. And start things off with an air four. Just get that damage into all of the enemies right at the start. So priorities in this particular battle, well, it's going to be another mirror of the previous battle. They are likely going to put their beasts in similar locations. I am fine with that. I actually am very happy with how this last battle went and would prefer a complete repeat of what happened during it, but... Butterfly effect is always happening, so what is going to be different? That will be the key here. There will be something that ends up happening that will be different. We shall see what that ends up being. I'm going to take that route, like I did last time. Lixara needs to steal again. I'll steal from EG this time. She will have a quicker turn to use Ameliorate, but the thing is, uh, Langston is likely going to be out of range of Ameliorate by the time she can use it on him. So she will have to teleport to that side of the arena again so she can heal him, essentially. That beast is gonna go next to... Yep, that's the exact same placement. I am happy with that. Those are all the exact same placements as the last battle, so we are good thus far. Ah, good. I can do this without teleporting. Awesome. Awesome possum. Hit you again. Don't forget the Chandler has the miter. Holy miter, should say. Do, 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 do. Ah, you're going that away. Oh, so you're going after EG this time. Okay. Um. Actually, Valens. Valens can farm affinity on one of these things. That's actually a decent move. Use Valens to farm some affinity. Ah, very nice. Petrify? No. But HP down, that's really nice, and initiative down. Always happy with that. Thank you for coming to me. I am always happy to see that. Um, you've actually taken a lot of damage. Do 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 do. -do. Yeah, very nice. Combo three, go. Death happened twice, that's good. Uh, no, I'm not gonna bother. Just, uh, just pass. And then steal. From whom? 
Um, hmm. Sure. Steal from her. She doesn't have a full three, but meh. At this point, I'm going all out on, uh... On my blog. Attacking. She is going to be combat uh, channeler, essentially, from here on out. Because I do not foresee the need to uh, have to heal anyone else in this particular battle. Yeah. So... She is gonna move to there? Maybe? No. We are going to teleport to there. Are we? Yes, we are. And we're gonna be a little tricksy here. Just a little bit tricksy. Gods, grant me We're gonna strength. let Langston finish that other guy off. Why? Because the this guy who's about to die summoned this water beast, and I want to use this water beast to get some affinity on Valens before it goes away. Which it will go away, likely to poison. Ooh, you moved. Okay. I'm fine with that. That's okay. That's great. Ooh, the repost. Awesome. Ow. So, uh, yeah, finish you off. Looks like I'm not gonna have con uh, assault um, Chandler here. Cause that guy, other guy's gonna die too. Um, you know what? We're gonna do this. Maybe we'll get uh, death raining down. Do 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 do. -do. Nope. Death is not raining at the moment. Really? No, oh, I figured as much. Long shot one, attack anyone? Yeah, you. Hit him. Hard. Ow. Damn. Little early. Out of range of combo three. FML. Then I may as well just freaking pass and steal affinity the next time she gets to move. Surprises! All the surprises! That would put him within range of dying to poison. And yes, I will take from Marcilla. Fill myself up. Give me all the affinity as we go into the next battle. Gladly take all the affinity as we go into the next battle. Okay, that guy is dead as a doornail. And the other guy is not in my immediate range, or line of sight, I should say. Fudge. Didn't crit. Oh, there goes her shield. That's unfortunate. Smack him, please. Yeah. All the smacks. Ah, good. You're within my line of sight now. But only within range of combo three. I'd rather not. Uh, sleet? Yeah, sleet. Go ahead. 
freeze the bastard. Ice storm. Freeze that bastard. And then immediately unfreeze that bastard. We're actually doing really well. I want to point that out. Wow, that shield is still not down. That shield is still not down. Do you realize how amazing that is? That that shield is still not down. And the death. Good. Though it wasn't needed. Wave 4 completed. On to wave 5. The final wave. Would you look at that? Serenantet! School of Valens, we meet again. Serenanutet. For the last time! And he uses Hell's Fury and it kills all of the summoners around him. You see, I've grown very powerful since last we met. Now prepare to die. Okay. Immediately start off with a long shot, too. He is immensely weak in terms of HP, but he is immensely powerful. Oh, right. There is that. Um, okay, so he's just going to summon immediately. Right on my path. That's just great. Yeah, you've got a lot of affinity there, buddy. I want it. I want that affinity from you. Catch me if you Let's can. go there. Sure, why not? I need to get everyone up to attack him. Realistically, I only really need one to get up to attack him. Why? Because Hell's Fury is fucking annoying. And I do not want anyone to die to it. Ah, uh, see, this is why I don't use Sprint, but I, it appears I did get the crit. Oh, yeah. Uh, again, Hell's Fury annoying as all fuck. Um, pretty sure she is officially dead. But, you know, part of me doesn't care. I'm not redoing this whole fight for that one. Goodbye, Fire Tempest. Do 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 do. No, you cannot steal my power. Ah! Well, guess what? I stole your power. Incognito, the marksman, the laugh master, number one fan. Yeah, she's dead. And a whole bunch of experience to make a lot of people level. So I'm going to need to get another secutor. We're going to need another Timmy. Ah, uh, but that would have been nice to have another secutor, but meh. Uh, yeah, here I stand because I did win.
So yeah, now we we get to save. Unfortunate, we did actually lose our first character permanently on this. Oh, all the surprises. All the surprises are gone, are done for. That was a pretty strong secular too, I might add. Oh well. Life happens. And death, I suppose. Realistically, I should have just done the fight with my ranged units, kept away from the even remote possibility of being Hell's Furied. But that does give us a free space now in our school. Actually, I need to go around the world and find a final team. That's a thing we need to do. Let's uh, go into Akaron. Because uh, since I'm thinking about this now, I need to... No, I need to go into the recruitment office and pick up... No, not the freaking shop. What am I doing? Need to go into the recruitment office and pick up the wolf I left behind a long time ago, because we actually need to fill our school with some wolves. Oh, but he's unfortunately level 15. <laughs> Uh, yeah, we're essentially getting our wolf back here, is the idea. Because if you remember, there's a league where we have to use beasts. And, uh, yeah, we're gonna need a lot of wolves. So, let's take a look at the characters that we used in that battle, who are still alive. Specifically, we had E.G., who now should have Hell's Fury. Skill was passed to the heroes who defeated Serenin and Tet. Ah, I hope that by using the skill, the Dark God will be vanquished once and for all. Yeah! Huge damage AoE. Only costs 3 SP, you can, and it's ranged. And it will kill everything. Oh, so EG has 33 points. She was working on affinity skills, right? Yep. So affinity 3. Valen's affinity 3. Even though he currently has a air weapon, but whatever. Erlin. Erlin, Erlin, Erlin. Uh, the reason to get the affinity skills on balance is, like, all of them, is because he will be able to get Omni Infinity with an Infinity Affinity once he gets the Munio Gear. Uh, essentially, one hit with the Munio Sword will give him a full five affinity and he can just chain off affinity fours all the time as long as he has all these skills so it's just being able to pick and choose what would be best for the situation at that point uh erlin is level 18 he's got nothing right now until next level ursula Fire 4, Decker, who happens to now have Hell's Fury, is still saving for an Affinity 4, yeah. Langston saving for more Affinity, or saving for more stuff as well. Ooh. Yeah, combos. Thanks on you. Cassidia still waiting to find out what I want to give her. Uh, let's see. Feroz. <laughs> you could use some combos, but I'm pretty much only using you for surprise attacks, so no. ER. Affinity 3. Yeah. No Amelia rate yet for you, so you're saving. You! You are the replacement for, uh... For our secutor that we lost, because I really do need it. Really do need that replacement for her, so this is gonna be the guy. 
who happens to be the one that I used. So, he has 30, 35 freaking points. What the hell am I going to give him? Off balance. Uh, that's the one thing that he doesn't have that I would want him to have that the other secretary had. The other secretary had sprint as well, but he doesn't. Which is interesting. I'd rather... I'm fine without sprint, I just want off balance. So when he hits 19, I'll give him off balance. Until then, though, there's really nothing I want to give him. You get Scorpion! Oh yeah, Scorpion. Scorpion, Scorpion. All the Scorpion, all the Scorpion. You're getting Skeleton next level. You're getting a combo now. I don't care about you, I don't care about you. And Odin really does need to level a lot. Just saying. So yeah, lots of Hell's Fury now. We have five characters with it. Unfortunately, we don't have a light with it, but we'll manage. We will manage. So at this point, what I can potentially do is essentially easily grind my way through the rest of the, the leagues that are available and get all my characters up to like 30 like really quickly because Hell's Fury is that damn strong. As long as there's a battle where I can use a character that has Hell's Fury. Okay, I'm back. For some reason, the mic, the, um, Adobe Audition 2014 is a little buggy right now. It, they just released it. It's a little buggy and it's not really behaving correctly. I'm going to have to go in and essentially make my little uh, file again that I use for my recording setup. Going to have to remake it from scratch because there's something wrong there using the old file, but whatever. It's the end of the video. I'm just wrapping things up right now. I think with that, I would like to just thank you all for watching. This has been LP Showbo 0099 and next time on Let's Play Gladius, we will... Start working on the remaining leagues in the game and like pretty much all the remaining battles. I'm just going to go through pretty essentially all the towns individually. We're going to start in Imperia and we're going to go through each town and see what's newly available and what's been available that we haven't done yet and just do everything. And along the way, we're going to pick up some new characters. I want a Centurion, for instance. Uh, that is in my level range, and yeah, essentially that's what we're going to do. Uh, do bear in mind that with the two channelers that we have that are spares that will be leaving, plus that one spot that's in there that has the wolf in it right now, and the uh, scarab that I'm fine with getting rid of, we have a lot of spots available to us right now. Hell, we have a spare dervish we could potentially get rid of. That I'll likely get rid of to replace with something with a bit more utility. It all depends on how many leagues we have that are going to be coming up where we'll that will require having lights. Don't think there's all that many left, but... Yeah, um... I would prefer having just the two lights or having a second secutor essentially instead of two ba uh, two um, dervish I'd rather have two secutor again so I would like a replacement to Marcella so yeah I'd like to thank you all for watching this has been LP Showboat 0099 and I will see you all next time